Hi, welcome to the 2016 Stewart Boat Show. We're here on a beautiful sunny Saturday, unlike a very rainy Friday, which we're glad's behind us. And I'm on board a Blue Water 2550 we've recently completed for an owner out of Jupiter. Um, this boat's got uh, pretty much all the bells and whistles. It's going to be a combination family fun boat as well as a fishing boat. Uh, so the owners installed the front seating, which I'm sitting upon, uh, as well as some other options to keep the uh, family comfortable when they're at the sandbar or out just having fun. Uh, these seats are completely removable, so when the time comes to go fishing, they come out. They'll actually store in the coffin box below my feet, or you can leave them at home in the garage, your choice. Um, but it does give you a lot of options uh, as to how you can utilize the boat. Uh, this particular boat was fitted with our Blue Water in-house hardtop. This hardtop's fitted with uh, spreader lights forward and rear. It's got um, strip lights built into the top so you have some subtle lighting at night as well as an electronics box for your stereo and your VHF. And um, boat has a really nice cooler built into the front of the console. Um, it's quite large inside and it's very well insulated. This cooler will hold ice for a couple days and um, so it's a, it's a, a great cooler and uh, very, very, uh, very, very efficient. This is our sport style cushion package. Um, we do this on a lot of boats these days. It's a little bit more complex a cushion uh, as opposed to the standard cushions which you can see over there on the Blue Water 2150 um, which are the standard flat cushions with just the regular stripes. These are a little bit more sculpted. Uh, they're a little bit more stylish. Um, but um, both cushion packages are available. It's a matter of personal preference. Now, this 2550 originally was configured with just a flat dash, and uh, the owner decided that he wanted to put on dual screens. So we, we modified the boat to use our recessed dash with the dual screen option, which is full width. And one of, the, one of the drawbacks to going with the full width is that you lose the glove box that everybody likes so much because it's your nautical junk drawer. It's a great place to throw your, your uh, wallet, your cell phone, there's a 12 volt outlet in there, you can charge your phone, and when you lose that, you've got no place for all of that. So what we've done on this boat is we've, we've moved all that down here. So now he's got a nautical junk drawer with a lip in front so things don't fall out. And there's actually a shelf in here with another lip on top so you can throw your wallet, your cell phone on top, you can throw suntan lotion, lures, any of stuff that you just need a place to throw stuff and get it out of your way in a hurry on the bottom. It's a nice acrylic finish, it's lockable, and so uh, now you have the best of both worlds. You have two displays, these happen to be Garmin 10 inch displays. You can put actually 16 inch displays in here if you choose. They take up a lot of space, but there is room for them. But most people opt for either the 10s or the 12s. Uh, there's a bunch of light switches here to control the lights on top and two 12 volt outlets. So if you're on the boat with two people who want to charge their cell phones, you can let your phone rest in here plug in your uh, your chargers there and um, the boats configured with three gauges one for each motor and one is a general gauge to offer your fuel economy and whatever whatever other information you may want while you're out running and uh, trim tab controls are nice and handy the console is nice and ergonomic it's easy to operate the boat from here you got a clear view there's nothing in your path looking forward stereo is right up on top VHF is easy to access and there's no springs or gas shocks holding this. These are friction hinges, so again, everything's open and clean. And when you're done, that just snaps in place and it's closed. You've got a VHF external speaker here, so when this is closed, you can still hear what's going on on the radio. And you've got another strip light in the top here, so in the evening, you can put a soft, subtle light over the cockpit here, light stuff up in the evening. This bag here is for your life jacket storage. Um, we've done it so that there's no visible fasteners or string showing, it's nice and clean. And this is our upgraded tackle center. This unit we do for our 25, our 28, and our 35. We've got rod holders, some cup holders, and um, this is a nice open area. You've got places for your uh, leader wire. You've got a nice bin here, which will hold uh, your rigging bits. And then this will actually hold your plano boxes which are down here and these will come out you set this on top and while the boat's rolling or bouncing around you don't have to worry about it going anywhere so it's a nice functional unit keeps whoever's rigging right in the center of the boat out of the way so people can still move on both sides high quality stainless steel locking latches so you can put your stuff in here and lock it up when you're done and there's still room for a pull out cooler underneath again because this is a family boat we've got a back seat in here although the 
A lot of people who fish the boat like the back seat as well after a day out on the water. It's nice if you've got a long run from offshore coming back in. You get a couple guys sitting on the back seat, a couple guys sitting on the leaning post. Everybody's got room. You can sit down, relax, have a beer, and enjoy the ride in rather than standing and hanging onto a handrail someplace and banging around. So that's a quick overview of our 2550 here at the Stewart Show. Uh, if you'd like more information about our boats, you can give us a call at the shop at 772-464-3735. You can see us on the web at www.bluewaterboats.com or send us an email at bwboats at earthlink.net. You guys have a great weekend. Hopefully the weather will hold out for Sunday as well, but today is beautiful. If you got some time, come on by and see us at the show. Take care, guys. Have a great day.